Hi, today I'm going to introduce our work cap, which is the plus attributes prior, adapting optimization to heterogeneity and fairness objective. Modern machine learning problems often involve large number of classes to predict. Collecting high quality training datasets for all of these classes is not always possible, and realistic datasets suffer from class imbalance, missing or noisy labels. So modern classification problems exhibit heterogeneity across individual classes. Each class may have unique attributes, like the sample size, label quality, predictability, which means that this class is easy or difficult to be classified, and also the variable importance at test time. Without care, this heterogeneity impedes the learning process, most notably when optimizing fairness objectives. We propose a general method to personalize the optimization strategy of individual classes so that optimization better adapts to heterogeneity. In detail, CAP is a meta approach that generates a class specific strategy based on attributes of that class. It leads to big improvement over naive approach of assigning separate hyperparameters for each class. What attributes will we use and how we use them? We extract high-level attributes from classes and use attributes to generate class-specific optimization strategies. The strategies are corresponds to hyperparameters. Our primary goal with CAP is building an attributes to hyperparameter function, A2H, that generates class-specific hyperparameters based on the attributes associated with that class. Then how to do that? As shown at the top of the figure, there are many types of heterogeneity. The dataset has good sample size, and some classes are easy to classify, some are difficult, which is defined as pre predictability. Some classes may have more noisy labels than the others. We use those as attributes A. Suppose there are total N attributes. Each AI is one specific attribute. We will use a nonlinear feature map f, which is a set of functions. With function f and attribute a, we could get the feature dictionary. The h can be parameterized by a weight matrix. Our goal become finding w so that resulting strategy maximize the target validation objective. W ties all classes together during training through weight sharing so it could protect the training of small classes. Then how to use CAP for loss function design? WL delta are hyperparameters that can be tuned to optimize the desired test objective. Then instead of training S, whose dimension is decided by the number of classes, we will train W. The size of W is only influenced by the number of hyperparameters we use and the feature map size we design. This is actually important because the total number of classes, which is k, could be very large. ImageNet has k, which is equal to 1,000. iNaturalist have k, which is equal to 8,142 classes. Each row of the feature dictionary is the features related to the attributes of class k. We generate the strategy vector like this. We list the potential attributes in the table. Any class-specific method feature could all be used as an attribute with cap. The table shows that the results of bilevel optimization. The table shows that cap is truly outperform other methods. Also, different attributes can shape the optimization process differently. Using difficulty achieves smallest standard deviation of class conditioned errors, which means that the result is more fair. The combination of frequency and difficulty show that multiple attributes provide more information about the dataset, which can work together to improve the performance further. Besides bilevel training, we also add CAP to postdoc logic adjustment. Also, CAP works well for various fairness objectives. So to summarize, those are our contributions. We utilize the hello attributes of individual classes to personalize the optimization process. Also, we show the benefits of CAP for designing class-specific loss functions and post-hoc logic adjustment. Still, we achieve significant improvement when optimizing fairness objectives other than balanced accuracy.